talked about her laugh. <sighs> and it, it brings a smile to your face. But then it brings tears. Because you can't hear it no more. You can't see her, you can't hear it. Half a decade too long, a Kokomo family's daughter, sister, and granddaughter disappeared five years ago today without a trace. Now they're asking the community to step up and help find her and sharing their memories with WRTV's Nikki Dementry. On October 11, 2016, Karina McClurkin was last seen on South Washington Street here in Kokomo. In the five years since, her family and friends have never stopped looking for her, and they're praying they find her soon. It's just embedded in my mind. It's just embedded. Jerry McClurkin can never forget the day her granddaughter disappeared. This is how she usually looked, right here. Karina, just 18 at the time, disappeared after a party. Police say she was last seen walking down South Washington Street in Kokomo, a few blocks away from Foster Park, where I met with her grandmother. I drove with the same pictures in my car for five years in my windshield. And I still have people to this day from Kokomo come up and ask me, what's wrong, where's she at? And we, I have to tell them we don't know. Karina is a sister, an aunt, a daughter, and a granddaughter. Her family says they've looked for her tirelessly these last five years. Over 500 miles in and around Kokomo from Jonesboro to uh, Burlington, Peru, to past Alto. We have covered every woods we drive by. We would stop and knock on doors and see if we could walk through them woods. Kokomo Police tells WRTV Karina's case remains open and active. The department notes investigators, quote, have pursued numerous leads and tips. We want her back. But that's not enough for Karina's family and friends. I don't even have any hope left. I'm tired. They want both the police department and community to step up. Why well, only remember her two days out of the year when everybody else is getting national coverage? Karina existed. She was not our imagination. Jerry says she will never stop looking for her granddaughter, so her family will be at peace. Not until the day I die. No, I won't. Karina's family and friends will start here behind me at the Dollar General to walk in her honor on this five year anniversary. They hope that by walking it brings awareness and encourages someone in the community who knows something to say something to bring Karina home. In Kokomo, Nikki Dementry, WRTV. Well, the Kokomo Police Department believes someone knows what happened that October night and they're asking the public to keep sending in tips. Those who want to share what they know anonymously can do so through Central Indiana Crime Stop. That number there is on your screen. It's 317-262-TIPS.